How's it going, everyone? We're here playing some Black Ops 4. Oh, I got level 1000. This is actually the first level 1000 I've ever run into so far, at least during this today's session. I think I ran into one beforehand, but this is the first time I ever ran into one today. That's pretty interesting. Oh, uh, I thought I'd give it a second chance, because the first time I tried it, I was like on a TV, and it didn't end well. Because this is like one of those like rare, like sweaty Call of Duties, where you're like, you know, you just like have to play on a monitor, else you like kind of that or it's a god but like I, I can't really play games on the tv there's no chance the side is like too weird you know it's hard to get used to but i mean why not now that i'm playing on a monitor actually it's actually pretty okay like i'm doing pretty all right probably has a lot to do with the fact that i'm playing with a vmp which is like basically the best gun in the game i think there's one better but i'm not i don't know what, it's, what it is I'm just, I'm just using this it's actually pretty good I don't really have much else unlocked. I'm like, I'm actually level 20. You level quite quickly in this game. I'm pretty sure it's because I like double XP is like 24 seven now. It's kind of just what they do with their old games nowadays. Like all like all like the next gen games just have permanent double XP. Honestly, pretty neat. I, I, I like that. So, stuff's pretty cool. Ah, this is probably the only Call of Duty where I like consistently have a positive KD. Which is kind of a sad thing to say, considering the fact that I run a Call of Duty YouTube channel, where I literally just play the game. But, I mean, yeah, I actually always do pretty alright. Like, last game, like, for the first half of it, I got, like, a 5kd, which is absolutely nutty. But then I just slowly started falling, as, like, everyone else on the other team just started getting streaks. I'm, I'm having a great time, honestly. This is, like, one of my new favorite Call of Duty. I think I'm going to be playing this, like, very often. I might stream it. You can check out my Twitch. I, I might maybe stream it at some point, honestly. I'd love to. Whoa, why did I have to run out right then and there, dude? Why, man? I'm, I'm mostly just playing Ruin. I don't know. I just think it's like the funniest one. And also, I like the grapple gun. The gravity the gravity spike or whatever it's called. I think it's the gravity spike, but don't quote me on that. It, it kind of sucks. I'm just going to say that. It, it's it, it's it's kind of rough. Like, it's very hard to actually get like a kill with it. Especially compared to Black Ops 3. Where it's, pretty, it's pretty powerful on Black Ops 3, honestly. And this game is kind of mid. But that's how it is. Guy's so lucky he got a headshot on me. I would have annihilated him if he didn't. Okay, what did I do wrong? Long barrel, fast mag. Okay, I just got lucky, that's all. Alright, fair enough. I was also playing this game on my friend Orisk was streaming. He had to private the VOD because he like banned some like random ass nerd from the uh, from his server which he was streaming on and, and like it ended up accidentally leaking his IP. So that's kinda awkward. But I was playing it on stream. This, this game is definitely really fun. I feel like it got a little too much hate at launch, but that's just literally just every single Call of Duty. I don't think there's been a single Call of Duty where people didn't hate it at launch. People didn't like Black Ops 1 at launch. People hated Black Ops 1, and now it's like widely, widely regarded as like number one by some people. Like the greatest Call of Duty game. I wouldn't... I mean, I don't know. I, I love the campaign. Like, I absolutely adore it. Easily the best campaign of all of the Call of Duty. Second, be, second being World at War. But I don't know, the multiplayer is kind of clunky. Like, I love all the stats stats and stuff. Like, I love how detailed it is. But, like, I, I feel like just, like, going around, like, shooting shit, it's, like, really, like, odd. I don't know, it just doesn't feel normal. Like, you lose so many fights that just, like, you just should not have lost whatsoever. It's really rough. I don't know why this guy's so cracked this game. I, I don't know what he's doing. He just randomly gets more kills than me. He has, like, a damage buff on his gun or some bullshit. What? I don't know. I, I don't know what's wrong with this guy. What the fuck? How could I possibly guess that there's someone there every single time? How? Okay, this is one of the- I guess I don't really like this map that much. I'm just stay scoped and I'm like a fucking tactical rainbow- I'm playing a rainbow six siege right now, guys. Of course, that's how I get the kill. Not even- I didn't get a single kill! Uh, I'm, I'm at a loss for words, man. Why is it like, it's like the moment I start recording, I just have like an awful time, but like last time I was having a great time. I just like randomly started entering sweaty lobbies now. The game doesn't have skill base. I don't, I don't fucking know what's happening, dude. I have no clue. I'm just like randomly doing garbage. I still love this game though. This game is actually pretty awesome. Fuck you. Alright, well, it was in progress. So that's just how it is, I guess. 83 and 100. We lost. I was going to keep grinding this game now because I just learned there's like multiplayer achievements and stuff. Like a ton of them. Like there's like a ton of like mastery stuff as well. It's like really hard. Like 2% of people have them. But I'm mostly going for like get level 55 and all that stuff, you know. Or I'm not playing that lobby. Oh no. Okay, see this cool feature? It's called lobbies which don't disband. I made a whole video on it. I wonder what happened to it. Maybe they added it back in every Call of Duty game. Maybe they 
removed it to propagate some dumbass fucking stupid skill based matchmaking garbage. I should also bring my custom emblems. That's definitely a missed feature, no doubt. Although they also also people would like put like just like make the absolute worst stuff on there possible. Which I mean there's no real way to moderate it except for having like incredible Google AI image sensors. Alright, I'll open the supply jobs boys. Here we go. So supply crate number one, let's check this shit out. Okay. Camos. Uh, it's, it's not even for guns I- Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, thanks for watching.